Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Agarian Skies. So today we're going to go ahead and finish off the sand because we do need the spore so we can um, start on another quest. So I figured since we already have the sand, why not? Let's just, let's just see if we can get some spores here. <laughs> and if not, well, we tried, you know? <laughs> So yeah, that's basically what we're gonna do, um, and hopefully, 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 we can get some other stuff too as well. So, um, so yeah, let's just sit back and see what the day brings us. Ah, oh, so yeah, it's, it's been really busy. Um, got a lot of things going on and. Um, so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, so yeah. I'm really hoping these spores drop. That would be amazing. But I don't know if it's going to or not. Oh, I got an exotic seed. I think those grow into jungle trees. So, um, which is good because then we can start growing our, um, cocoa beans. I don't know if we'll ever need them, but... I like cocoa beans, right? <laughs> so, um, hey, it's a start. We gotta start somewhere. So, yeah. It's been busy. And, uh, I really love doing this, uh, Gary and Skies. It's, a, it's definitely a nice change from, um, Evila Solo. So, yeah. Um,. Ooh, and we got um, that too. So that's another kind of cactus. Um, so that's good. So see, it was worth it. Um, except for we still didn't get any spores. So we're definitely going to have to um, spend more time doing some sand. That's for sure. Oops. But, until then, we need to see what all we need. I, we're definitely going to need redstone and, like, lots of it, so. Yeah, and we still need those, too. Um. Darn it. I don't want to sift all my dirt. I worked so hard to get this dirt. But, I think that's the only way we're going to be able to do it, I think think. Maybe. Well, we got sugar cane seeds, so that's promising. Definitely gonna need that, especially with the sword that we have. Um... This is gonna use up all my stuff! Hmm. What's that? A spruce seed? This better be it. Nope. It shouldn't be this hard. Hmm. Yes, we got one. <laughs> All right, so now we'll go out here and cut down one of these trees. I think we'll cut down this one, maybe. All right, and that way we can go ahead and get some saplings up and going. Um, apparently there's a quest in here, and I know there is, and it tells you how to do that, but um, we're not ready for that quest yet, so that's why I couldn't um, look into it. Um, and I've done this before, but I just couldn't remember, so I'm glad the dirt ended up being right. Um, I tried to Google it, but all I was getting was like everybody's Let's Plays, and I'm like, I don't really have time to sit here and watch everybody's Let's Plays. Because... Um, 
who knows how long it'll be in the video before you even find out what you want to know. So I was like, uh, I found one and I was like trying to go through it really fast and I was like, oh, I don't got time to do this. So hopefully when I go to edit this video, I'll remember that and I can cut that part out. <laughs> hopefully I will remember. That's half the battle. All right, so let's go ahead and get this going. We just need one um, for now and hopefully it'll give us a lot of saplings from that, so. Okay, well, oh, we can go harvest the carrots. See, that's just the best way to do it, is just to get the carrots right up front, because um, then you don't, you're not struggling for food. So, pro tip to anyone out there who wants to uh, do this mod pack. <laughs> get your carrots. It helps. Okay. Um, so now at least we'll have plenty of grass seeds and stuff like that. Alrighty. And we really should go plant um, this uh, this um, exotic seed so we can go ahead and start getting the jungle tree planted here. Right. Get some more of these saplings. I need to, um, once we get the cobble farm going, we're going to spend some time and get more land open up so we can start expanding some stuff here because we need to get um, a better tree farm system going. We're not going to make an automatic one just yet um, but I definitely want to get something going than just two trees. So that is definitely something to consider and think about here. Um, what I might do um, is um, in the week of the recording of Eve Lila Solo, I may come on here and uh, l like level this hill out and uh, get rid of all this extra clay here and then use the clay to help add on to the directions that we're going to expand because we're going to expand out that way, this way, and this way. Um, we are not expanding out that way because I don't want to deal with the cats and stuff. So... Um, but I may try and get that done and then get this hole over here filled up and then maybe get like a bigger area for some squiddos to start spawning, um, you know, just to help speed some stuff up along better. Um, so yeah, we got two different kinds of trees growing now. So anyways, let's get back in here and uh, figure out what else we need here. I know we're going to need redstone, so we're, we're going to have to get some dust for sure. Um, okay. So, and we're going to need... Yeah. Alright, well, we're probably going to need a little bit of everything, to be honest. Um, because there's that which that's like the most expensive part to build in all honesty and then um, and then we're gonna need the survivalist generator here 
that one's actually pretty cheap to make so um, we're gonna we're missing the redstone though but we could go ahead and build a furnace I guess boom <laughs> all right so basically what we need to do now for sure is to get more dust and um, so we definitely need to go get some more um, uh, gravel and get it all turned into dust so I guess that's um, all we have to really do this episode um, just so we can finally start moving on I guess you know so yeah we'll just sit here and bust blocks that sounds amazing right <laughs> actually I think that's all we really can do I don't think there's anything else we can do at the moment um, cause that's gonna require more sand, this quest here. We can't do this until we get the mob spotter going. Um, and this is gonna need redstone, that's gonna need redstone. So basically we're trapped, and this is gonna, we're gonna need, uh, sugar cane for this. Actually, let's go ahead and start getting some sugar cane up. Um, that way we can get that going. I thought we just had that. Mm. Oh, <laughs> it's already in there. Okay, um, <laughs> I think we already have the dirt on us, so let's, uh, Let's, um, hmm, maybe, maybe this block right here. Let me see. Yeah, and then we could plop that down like that. And then we can get that going. So that'll be sugar cane growing eventually. And then we need to get the cactus growing too, but we'll worry about that when we get this other stuff built um, and taken care of, cause yeah. So anyways, back to chopping. <laughs> I know, not the most favorite thing in the world, but there's not that much long in this video, uh, much longer to go in this video, so um, We'll just go ahead and get this done and be done with it. Um, I don't think we need like a ton of redstone, but the trick of that is, is you, as you guys have seen, you sieve and sieve and sieve and it's just luck, you know, and there's no guarantees of what and how much of what you're gonna get. It's just based on your luck. So, um, some people get stuff a lot quicker than others and, um, it just all boils down to luck. So, yeah. I mean, we've already seen, like, how many stacks of gravel, and we still haven't even seen a sign of diamonds and emerald yet. So, it just goes to show that this, uh, may not be so kind to me this in this mod pack. So, um, luck may take us a while, I guess. And for those of you who are playing Agarian Skies and you like, um, say, well, you could go do something else in another chapter. Well, yeah, I could, but we're still going to be back here where we are now. So, I mean, we're going to have to get stuff done eventually, and we need more space um, to do some of those other things. Like, uh, we need a bigger house so we can make better storage. We need um, bigger plots so we can start doing the kitchen quests. Um, so, you know, we're going to need more space to put everything. So, it's kind of like, you just kind of have to be patient and um, take it for what it is and work with what 
work with what you've got, you know, so, um, yeah, basically that's what this mod pack is, but it's still a lot of fun, it's funner in multiplayer because then you can kind of go around and see what everybody's up to, and, um, I guess if you wanted to, you could kind of make a game out of it and see who gets what done faster, but, um, uh, but I don't have any means for multiplayer at the moment, so not in this mod pack, so, um, till then, it's just me, alright, one hammer down, yeah, so there was glass there, right there, um, but when I was farming, uh, gravel, uh, <laughs> yeah, it didn't work out so well, um, yeah, that didn't work out so well. The glass broke, and I was like, oh, man. So I had to throw a piece of cobble down there. Mm-hmm. Yep. It happens. You know? So there's not that much long here on this video, so you guys will be spared for now. Um, so I'll probably just go ahead and get the rest of this. And then the next time you guys see me, we'll have dust. So that sounds good to me. Well, you guys don't have to watch all of this. But anyhow, Thank you all for watching, and thank you for subscribing. And if you haven't already subscribed today, well then you totally should. <laughs> so please do remember to hit that like button, and if you guys are really feeling ambitious, please remember to share these videos and make some comments. And, um, you all take care and have a wonderful day, and I will definitely see you next time on Eve, or well... I'll see you on something, <laughs> probably another Agarian Skies, so I will see you there, so you guys take care of yourselves, and yeah, so bye!